What's going on guys? I'm back with some more World of Tanks. I'm driving out my Hetzer once again. This time we're on Erlenberg. XV I'm saying this is a could go either way. Though it started off on a sour note with our buddy in the stern panzer over there deciding he needed to go for a dip. Yeah, you know, maybe you should have waited till the battle was lost before you decided to drown yourself, buddy. Anywho, I've come over to this little hill right here that most tank destroyers come to because I wanted to sit here and just snipe at people coming down the west. Fortunately, it doesn't work out that way. Though I get to duel my evil twin over there for a little bit. And managed to leave him on seven health figures. And the looks gets the kill. Lovely. Just my kind of luck. This is usually a pretty good spot to sit if you're sniping fools. But it's pretty exposed. <laughs> Already right there. Just barely missed. So, got kind of lucky. I was going to go back to defend the base, but it was already taken care of. And this looks wants to be a team player. And spot for me. So, cool. Let's do teamwork. <laughs> and he manages to kill that tank destroyer before I can even get a shot at it. Yeah, he doesn't really need to spot for me, because he could probably kill most of everything on the enemy team. So... Anyway, he's leading the charge, and I'm sticking behind him, trying to support him. When he runs into a T-28, and leaves him on 10 health. So, I'm going to return the favor. He took my 7 health kill, I took his 10 health kill, and then Artie slaps him right in the face. Yeah, he's not too happy about that one. And neither am I, because I just lost my eyes. So if I'm going to get any more kills, I have to go looking for him. And no chance at all of hitting that Matilda building in between us. Though I know if I come around this hill and peek out from these bushes right here, I'll find Artie, because they never leave the cap circle. I get lucky with a snapshot and take away half his health. And he immediately slaughters that Kiho. Sucks for you, bro. And he's looking to get a shot at me, but he's not quick enough on the draw. His buddies aren't too happy about that. <laughs> and how much you want to bet the rest of artillery is sitting right here behind the cap circle? Of course they are. You know the answer to that already. It's artillery. They don't move more than 50 yards in a match. Just peek up over this hill, and... Surprise, surprise. They're both here. This one's trying to... Drown himself, I guess? <laughs> He's not doing it right. So, I help him out. It looks like somebody's already taken care of the other artillery, so last threats, that M8, and he's taken care of. So now the last man standing is that Stug. He's all the way over here in B.O. So if I was smart, I would have just sat here and farmed some loser points. Because there's no chance of me getting over there in time to take a shot at him. I mean, we've got Matilda, Stug, Valentine, all pushing his position, and he's got a hill between me and him, so I can't take a shot at him, even if I do spot him. Which, yeah, he spotted. Nope, can't get a shot. Looking back, thinking I should just return to the cap circle. <laughs> but I'm committed. And in the end, already takes him out. So, if I had just stayed in the circle, I could have got a few more points. Anyway, let's check out the results from that one. So, that times five, though, right? <laughs> yeah, 
yeah, this was what, during one of those events, and I usually don't play during them because they're full of assholes and idiots, but this one turned out to be worth it. I don't think it's enough to encourage me to play more, though. <laughs> Catch you next time, folks.